Love it when you're mad. Gets my southern blood pumping. Get in, or I change my mind. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know, Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. I think Judy's lying. Why? Little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. Jack in, please. Huh. I'm sorry. Did she finally say anything useful? Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. You better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much. Even for me. Well, aren't you the king of fuck-ups? You're not helping. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toy's wet dream. Still don't see how Mikoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on the stage, are ya? Oh my, the place has a wicked vibe. Is this more up your alley than clouds? Hey, at least here you know what you're getting. Smells like proper methionine. Must be cooking RPM here. RPM. Used to sprinkle it on my breakfast. Come on, is it really that hard? Please, just one. For me? Fine, have it your way. Smoke to your lungs content. Ah, oh, finally. Something better than exhaust in the stench of the city. Don't tell me you don't feel it, too. Listen, I know you've got some serious questions that she's got the answers to. I mean, if I were you, I'd want to know, too. But it's just not gonna happen. She's completely out of it. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Um, Johnny? Pretty sure they turned your great spot into a slurp shop. Mindless fucking consumerism wins the day again. All right. Proof. How'd Samurai's third ever dig in? Hey, Johnny, get your digital ass out here. Feed me my lines. How about this? Fuck you, V. Ain't your stupid sidekick. How poetic. A monk in distress. They should include this in your epic. What are you gonna do? Cross your legs and meditate till they drop dead? Wish you'd drop dead. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drum. Shit, it keeps giving me an error. Odd. Let me work around it. And now, Pan Am, here's Johnny. Out in the middle of bumfuck nowhere. Great work, V. Hey, uh... Know what? You're starting to remind me of me. Fifty years back. Minus the charisma. An impressive cock. Oh, let me guess. You already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little while. No. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny. Kidding. But watch out, suit's getting ready to talk your head off. Know what? That's enough. You just playing for time? Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? Cause I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Oh, finally. You're a dick, you know? And you're a cunt. Maybe we'll fit together after all. On behalf of the staff of the Independent California Motel, I wish you all sweet dreams. <sighs> Christ on a stick! Finally, something that isn't a complete snore fest. 
could binge watch this all day if I had some popcorn. Come with us. You'll find out all you need to know on the way. Got to object strongly. Noted. But you don't have a phone here. Ha! <laughs> That's it. Got no fucking idea what this is about. But if you don't go with them, I'm never talking to you again. Powerless. What do you think? Not anymore. God exists. Fuck. Kill me, please. Red Queen's race. Cause any inner synapse zaps? Sure, a bunch of old Brit farts and powdered wigs shouting off with their heads. You know, you're allowed to say you don't have a clue. The terminal crashed right as he went through the gate. Yeah, glitch is no accident. Nah, seen stranger coincidences. Like? Like when you bang some chick and then her sister later, same night. And it turns out they're both sisters of God. That really happened to you? Nah. But it could've. Could've chromed half the city with what he was packing. Probably what happened. Body disappeared from the morgue, sight unseen. And then some pig got himself a new set of wheels and an ugly-ass suit. Know that? We're just talking out your ass again. Once you've seen all I've seen, don't need to know things to know them. People are the same everywhere. Okay, it's coming out your ass. Cops seem to like you. Careful this one doesn't start sending you out for donuts. What? No, River's all right. For a cop, you mean? Not every cop's a bastard. Just like not every rocker boy's a narcissistic dickhead. Don't know, V. You ever actually met a rocker boy who didn't fit that description? All in all, no. Used meds. Intruder make a beeline here after Jeff tagged him. Talking to yourself again? More and more. Ever since this terrorist started stalking me. Don't lose him, V. Oh, now you're interested. We could expose a corpo conspiracy here, V. I'm telling you. They could be corpo spies or who the fuck knows what. Ah, oh, fuck a dog doll. One thing I know like I know my own name. You do not poke around strangers' cool boxes. Best case scenario, you find a half-gallon jug of rancid milk. Worst? Motherfucker up a sad mass. That's Raish Bartmoss. Raish who? What do you mean, Raish who? Bartmoss, for shit's sake. Gonk who fucking trashed the first net? Data crash? Rabbits? No pings? Jesus, what am I doing here? Who are you, even? Isaka scum to you, I know that. But Garo's not a bad guy. Not a bad guy. He was Saburo fucking Arasaka's bodyguard. Think his pretty eyes landed in that gig? Hanako-sama shall aid us in our mission. Or she'll make sure we die for good. Bakaneko got sick of us, looks like. Think they make these motels especially for royal fuck-ups like us? AC's busted, dirty needles under the mattress, shitters clogged. No, for real. Who fucking comes here to sleep? We're a couple miles outside Night City. Someone leaving town just keeps driving. Somebody going there sleeps in the damn city. What good's a motel in the middle of nowhere? Johnny? Yeah? Shut your gonk mouth, please. Saying random shit ain't gonna help anyone. We got what we wanted. Don't tell me that proxy got to you. Fuck you. Come on, think about it. Yesterday, Hanako was living in a world that was completely safe for her. What she got on her hands now? A foreign city, a homicidal brother, and a fucking thief. It's why she sent a proxy. She's alone. And she's shitting herself more than we are. Uh-huh. Clink. What? Did you say clink? Mm-hmm. Sound of her attaching her leash. <laughs> Should have asked if he hadn't used hypos for sale, too. What could go wrong? Not now, Johnny. If you're not Alt, who are you? I use her engrammatic data. Really? 
You find this icy bitch aspect in there too? Okay, one more time. I'm just gonna talk to Rogue about Smasher, right? Gonna hand me the wheel and hop back in the passenger seat. That is the plan. Don't worry. I'll be gentle. You might even enjoy it. Actually, we're great this already. Look at that. Last played Bushido 10. Perfect. Looks like a spurt of runny shit. V, we're at a drive-in. Movie's the last thing we care about. Whoa. It's like symbolic. And here I thought I won the Darwin Award. I guess we have a new winner. What a fucking shit sty. Wasn't slumming it in squats like your whole thing? Sure, when I was skezzed out beyond all recognition. V? Don't tell me you're seriously considering this. Sticking our precious necks out for a bunch of whores? I was beginning to think you wouldn't make it. Right, wrong. Chicks will give you shit no matter what you do. This is not what we agreed. Look at me. See this? This is a look of unfucking surprise on I my face. I know the claws. Ugh, not a looker. Might even be worse than your place. Uh huh. Vapors from the room upstairs. Wait, wait, is that? If you are not uh, neo amphetamine. <laughs> mean to tell me you can pin the exact drug from just a whiff? <laughs> like a police dog or what? I'd say more like a a sommelier. Fugly as seafood barf. Hope it was expensive at least. Something's gotta justify this level of tacky. Dunno if you know, but once upon a time, this was Silverhands. Fuck, Nancy just gets shit done. She just whisper Mikoshi in her ear. We'll be all set. I dunno. Maybe this isn't such a good idea. Now you mention it? It's getting worse. Maybe this gig isn't worth it. Fine, go out and play. I'll just sit back, tend to my bleeding ears. Guess he had somewhere to be. Badly. Probably writing a new song as we speak. <laughs> Isn't that what you wanted? To make him feel better? Better, but not that good. Johnny, don't ever leave me again. I can't live without you. A little of that could go a long way. CD bars, betrayal, a beguiling woman. Sounds like something out of a pulpy noir thriller. Pepe was used to listening to his customers' complaints, but now it was he who needed to get something off his chest. It was the same old story. An unfaithful wife in a city where everything was uncertain. You about done. I'm trying to focus. It was her, the lady in pink, breaker of hearts. Framed by a halo of cigarette smoke, I followed her. Dreaming of the day the narrator put a fucking plug in it. Decided to step on her foot. Don't know why. Guess they don't call me a gumshoe for nothing. Doesn't even make sense. The woman looked around. Something weighed on her. Maybe it was my gaze. Keep this up. I'm a fucking puke. Narrate that. The woman passes a bum. Gives him a wide berth. Doesn't want her clothes dirty. Her conscience is already dirty enough. Oh, uh, seriously, what what did I ever do to you? The dame disappeared into the guts of a building ready to collapse. The air hung heavy with smog and betrayal. Ugh, maybe it's a good thing I'm dying. Sweet Jesus, you hear that? Do you hear what they're playing? Each to their own, Johnny. That's what peeps with bad taste always say. Don't know what he did to deserve what's coming, but his music taste is reason enough to drop it. What the... What the fuck is this? Close? Mm-hmm. Cheap knockoffs, too. Had real great intel, that Kirk. Like always, actually. But hey, could strike out on your own. Open up a stand in Kabuki, or maybe... Implants. Fucking Militech wear. I'ma shove these duds right up his ass. This well, that's what you get for a lifetime of hustling. Nice speech. Remind me not to invite you to my funeral. Well, well, well. Piss poor acoustics, that place. Biting came a close second. Grub was the worst. Of course, the chicks made up for that. Best pussy I ever ate. 
Please just ignore his babbling. It's a complicated relationship. Why do I even bother? Grr, this chick gets on my nerves. That's you and me, Blow. Just don't wake her up. Fuck, I feel like a dog's shit. Never mind the testicles. Tell him to keep those hands attended to. Always wound up in a ditch whenever Carrie drove. Well, well. Who knew Johnny Silverhand's a lover of fine art? Not me. One of my exes. She was a painter. Bonafide psycho. Like all of them. The sex, though. Can't even begin to describe it. Yeah, I'd really rather you didn't. We nail one asshole to the wall and another rises up in the polls. Politics is fucking usual. Sorry, Johnny, but I don't have time for your little anarchist revolution. Yeah? Well, it'd be easier than slicing heads off a fucking Hydra. One more reason this city could use another nuke. Why this obsession with Sweden fuck? Hoping once you find him, he'll spill the meaning of life? Here, I'll save you the trouble. Life makes no sense. With you in my head? Agreed. Now, how about some quiet time? I can't think. You stopped thinking long before I got here. But sure, blame it all on the guy in your head. Sig's a match with what Nancy was tracking. And goes further, out to the Badlands. Like a server proxy. Don't tell me that's where we're headed. Why shouldn't I? Because this is all one big waste of time. The fuck do you care about a Borg fucking Swede? He rubs out sayings like a randy teenager and the whole world's guzzling it up. The three branches of government is a lobotomy on the people's autonomy. I mean, what the fuck? Signal keeps going. Ha! I've got a feeling someone's messing with you, V. You'll follow this breadcrumb trail and when you connect the dots, all you'll see is a dick. I'm sure you would love that, wouldn't you? Fucking A, I would. That cock would be the first thing Swedenborg did that actually made any sense. Except he'd probably give it some pretentious name. Like, patriarchal phallus upholding toxic masculinity. What do you think? Fuck. Let me guess. Another router? My dick theory started to seem like a real possibility. Can we find whoever did this? I need to shake their hand. Unlikely. For two reasons. First, they didn't leave a trace. Second, you're dead, Johnny. Oh, right. When I get in a good mood, I forget that. V. Merck. Occasional client of Zane's. Johnny Silverhand, rock legend, voice in V's head. The and fuck, also, Johnny? Let me pretend I exist sometimes, okay?